It's a Michaelis. So I'm going to turn this island into a spider spawn. This is the spider farm. Alright. First things first, I'll go ahead and chop all the trees down. Don't worry about shells. Just kind of surveying the land. Then we're going to break all the rocks. And knock out any spawn spots where there could be bugs. Like where that stink bug is now. So, pick all the flowers, axe out, let's go here, Oop, actually, I meant to start with my net, to make sure there's no cool furniture things that I might possibly want, usually get some pretty good stuff from pushing trees. Gotten one with fruits, so I don't think they even spawn on those trees. Oh, there we go. Right. Mm, for good measure. I picked this island because the last one I did was the bamboo island, and there are tons of trees and lots of ground I have to shovel up. I saw a video on how to do it, but I kind of adapted my own strategy because it seemed to make more sense. What I do is I completely remove every spawn spot, like he says in the video, but I also dig up every hole so those mole crickets won't spawn. Like I have, I was doing two spots where mole crickets would spawn, and then I'd run these bugs off up here on the rocks. See. It'll all, it's all about to be. That's how I get the net. Yep. Alright, right, we're about to be able to get started. Big rock in the middle. spots where bugs can possibly spawn. I don't know, I haven't heard any of those mole crickets though. I may not have to do that. Which would be cool. Let me see. Just make sure to completely remove every tree. Don't want any stumps for beetles or whatever. Speaking of beetles, oh, I forgot to get the flowers. Looting. Right. Hopefully this actually lasts for me. the rest of this island. If not, I think I brought an extra. Yeah, I didn't 
Okay. Except for I don't hear any of those mole crickets, which would be awesome. That makes this a whole lot easier. Mm, no, I just heard one. <laughs> I've started getting rid of their spots for other bugs, so you end up with those. I think this is going to be something you have to do every time. You have to get it down to mole crickets. Just get rid of all their spawn spots down to like three or four. Mm -hmm. You don't have to empty the entire island. It's just a big chunk of it. And with these waterways I may have to do even less. So maybe a lot easier than the bamboo island. The bamboo island was hard because it's nothing but land. So I literally dug every spot on the bamboo island.
flowers and all. Next. The first time I did it, it took over two hours. It wasn't very efficient. <laughs> I didn't really have a plan. I just kind of went at it. This time I was pretty ready to just come in here and do it. I don't know what I need to do. The name of the game is blocking those spawns to where nothing can spawn but spiders and beetles or roaches or whatever they're called. So once you get it down to them, then it's a matter of just running off the spawns. And if you run off enough spawns, spiders will spawn, so it's about a minute and a half, I think. That's how long it takes to get them to show up. Eat one. Can't talk and play. <laughs> That's everybody's problem. I always hear that same thing. It's hard to talk and play. It really is. See, there's beetles. <laughs> it's fixing to be spiders. Oop, there's one right there. It already started. <laughs> and this is going to be a good one. Oh, there's two of them. Shoot. Hopefully I'll just get one's attention. I'll let that one run off. Get this one. Alright. Now this is the way I hunt spiders. Not everybody does it like this, I'm sure. But, i just push them a little bit and stop. Sit back down, push him a little bit, stop. Now I know my next one's gonna be within a whole distance. Boom, got him. Let's go catch another one. <laughs> I'm scared of that. <laughs> He's out in the water. Right, you see me, buddy? Mm -hmm. Sit down. Sit down. I think the next one's gonna be the one. And boom. Oh. I missed him, you got me. <laughs> Should have got a little bit closer. Oh well. But as you can see, it's already started. This is going to be a good run. Hmm. And I may need to start getting rid of my inventory too. Arcade seat. I'm probably keeping that for sure.
don't even need that extra shovel. I thought I was going to need. I'm dropping literally everything. Okay. Don't think I even need that. Well, maybe I do. And then. Nets and shovels. Another thing, I, I thought I had to catch those. And that just messed me up because it was not true. I ended up digging this whole island up so not to mess with it. And yeah, I'm actually going to do that starting right here. And so the name of the game is all about minimizing the spawn spots. Who showed up that fast? And this island already has a propensity to spawn spiders. So I'm using that word right? <laughs> Probably not. Okay. That's another thing too, is they spawn and kind of just go wherever they want to go. And they bug out. No pun intended. all the spots that the mole crickets could spawn. And I could predict where they were going to be. And I wouldn't have to worry about them getting bugged out on the dock or anything like that. Okay, yeah, I'm just going to finish where I started here. Because they'll probably get out here. Oh crap, there's a spot I can reach. So to make little like little structures like to the top side. I see there's one right there. <laughs> he said to do it like that so you could run in and out of it and then the spider couldn't get you. Which is cool, but how did he push the spawns by getting rid of all the crickets? Getting rid of the crickets. <laughs> Otherwise, you'll be chasing them around. Spend more time doing that than you will be fighting spiders. Because as you see, they're they're decently hard to find. <laughs> they give you a good vocal cue, but even then, it's it's pretty subtle. It's hard to follow. Yeah, this is gonna be way faster than Bamboo Island. Good lord. Got that entire thing. My water's taking up a large portion of all that work. And then you just stuff like that. <laughs> I hate having to do it 
backwards like this. This is the only way to keep me getting stuck <laughs> that I can think of. GameCube Joy Cons. I don't know if those are real yet, but whoever made those was awesome. do that. <laughs> oh, here one. See there's the one that's, that's one of the spawn spots where the beetle spawned. I'm gonna end up digging up this whole spot. I forgot about this guy too. It's rock. We got a fruit. Empty spot. Okay, there's a spotter spot. Sometimes they spawn in twos, as you saw earlier, so wherever that beetle was, there may be a spider out running around. I 
can see further down. Because you can do this and see way up in the horizon. But when you're going down, it's a little scary. <laughs> I have to do if I run out of spawns. Let's pick one to let it be a spawn. Just cover the bug, kick your back over it, and be done with it. Oh, there's a spotter. <laughs> I think the trick is to not move more than one hole. Like one hole space. I think it's the trick. I might be wrong. Mm, got him. Okay, there's a beetle. Hmm, some more roaches. Oh, this is the scary part. I haven't walked out. <laughs> Good spots over here for him anyway. Cricket. But yeah, what makes it so fast is getting rid of those crickets. If you left them up, see so there's two beetles they need to scare off. If you leave those crickets up, then take up all the spawns. They won't, won't spawn any spiders. This will take forever to learn. That's well, not a spotter, but that's one of the spots. Anywhere one of those beetles shows up, that's where a spotter can spawn. Oh, there he is. I gotta go downwards to catch this one. This is gonna be scary. <laughs> Just 
on the shit out of Spotter. This is how it goes about every other pass. You get one to two spiders. Start 
down on the old ah, Everything fucked up, got a phone call, it's loud
Almost done.
Almost dead. Try to get one or two more. I mean, that's the one. Okay, be done. That's the trick right there. That's the trick. Block them all and give a bunch of them in the whole group. Dig all those up. That's it right there. This next one's gonna be even faster. I bet if I go up there now, there's already spiders. Man, this can get so fast. 
doing just right. Get the right island. The right. Both this part. Watch them do it. I want to move. Okay. trick though. Choke out the spawns and then get a bunch of spawn spots. Choke them out. Repeat the process. Spotter. I mean, maybe I'll take it home. <laughs> maybe. Yeah.
hardest part is to stack them up in front of the house. <laughs> there we go, hold them in the attic. I got a little piece of furniture. A net I couldn't get rid of. <laughs> and all spiders. Tarantulas. <laughs> so many of them. No, I'll do a 6 by 6 <laughs> I'm gonna do that. <laughs> I'm gonna do that tonight. <laughs> Let's see. I need to do some editing, really. <laughs> but that may be what I'll do tomorrow. Just found out I'm off for the next week, so... I'm trying to make a lot more content. I've got two or three videos kind of saved up. Edit on. This is gonna be wild. <laughs> 